Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft is starting to introduce AR, artificial intelligence, into its different products. The main one here being, as posted, the use of the chatbot chat GPT in the new Bing search. And then as recently posted uh, last week, they have introduced the AR-powered Bing to the taskbar search with the Moment 2 update for Windows 11 that rolled out last week. And as posted, this Bing in the search is really at this stage just a glorified shortcut which at this stage currently just takes you over to the new Bing using Microsoft Edge. Now, in regards to artificial intelligence being used in Windows 11, in last week's latest uh, Windows 11 Insider Preview build, build 25309, which rolled out to the Dev Channel Insiders that I did post on, and I'll leave a link to that video in the description because it was packed with a whole lot of new features. And over and above the official features um, that rolled out, once again, there are a couple of references um, to strings and um, code that um, is hidden, which basically means Microsoft could be working on that code and those features internally. And this is in regards to the use of artificial intelligence in Windows 11 in the future. Now, um, the strings were spotted by the Windows enthusiast uh, Phantom Ocean 3 over on Twitter, uh, who says uh, in that tweet, for anyone interested, seems like a new AI-powered depth effects feature setting for background images is being worked on. And then um, they name the strings. Number one, the first string, depth effects. Number two, when available, use AI to add depth effects to background images. And then parallax background. And we'll get to that parallax background in a moment. Now, when it comes to adding depth effects, if we just head over to a screenshot um, provided by the Windows enthusiast Albacore over on Twitter in regards to those depth effects, yeah, we see a hidden feature with the setting depth effects. When available, use AI to add depth effects to background images, which you can obviously turn on and turn off to um, uh, obviously enable that setting. So, um, although these are hidden features, um, Microsoft hasn't officially confirmed them, but as I always say with hidden features and hidden code and strings and so on, uh, is a good indication that um, Microsoft could be working on that internally and could roll it out for official testing uh, in the future. Now, um, when it comes to um, Parallax, um, Microsoft could be adding Parallax effects to desktop images. But at this stage, um, not much is actually known how this will actually work. But um, it will provide depth effects, as we can see from that hidden uh, setting uh, in the screenshot. And at this stage, it uh, could be basically something very similar to a 3D effect, um, giving you a bit of a depth effect when it comes to um, images and your desktop wallpaper and backgrounds and so on. But with anything like Microsoft, um, only time will tell and we'll have to wait and see. But just on a side note, this desktop background, this wallpaper that I have on my, um, my screen at the moment was actually... Um, created using AR, artificial intelligence. And I did post a whole video on that, and I'll leave a link to that uh, in the description. And as you can see with this image, it does give you a kind of depth effect and a 3D effect. So maybe um, what that parallax is all about um, and the description as I've come up with in this video isn't too far off. But obviously, if anything does change with this new setting, the depth effect setting, I will post and let you know accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.